four, the four symbols of, of, of giving the hint. Alrighty guys, welcome to this video I'm going to be making. I'm going to record it now and it may be posted up a bit later on because I feel like, you know, it's not the right time of day to get a video up, but I'm going to record it now anyway. Um, I'm here to talk about a possible big match that WWE could plan for evolution. And I'll, and I'll tell you why this is a big possible match because it has been rumored for a long, long damn time now. And finally, it seems to be happening because Bailey uh, put out a tweet of her and Sasha wearing the exact same clothes to match their tag team gear. And Ronda Rousey replied to their tweet by calling them the fake four horsewomen. So, it seems like WWE are finally, you know, planting the seeds to the four horsewomen versus WWE horsewomen. And now, I want to tell you, be very upfront with you guys. I don't care if this match is going to happen. Honestly, I don't. If it's one of the WWE's big matches, then fine. You can do it. And am I am, am I going to be honest and tell you guys that I'm excited about this? Yeah, of course I am. But Marina Shafir and Jessamyn Duke haven't wrestled yet. But according to many sources, it has said that Marina Shafir and Jessamyn Duke have caught on to the whole WWE concept already. They've only been in WWE for a short period of time, and their training has been flawless. They're getting through the training quickly, and they've already learned nearly everything possible. This tells me that they have been wanting to get this out of the way. Now, of course they could save this for a WrestleMania. Sure, that's obviously the biggest thing that people would love it to be at a WrestleMania, but considering that this is the first ever all women's pay-per-view evolution why not have it there why not have it here at evolution it seems to be perfect enough I mean like we're getting a lot of legends coming back you know this event will be so freaking awesome if they had the if they play their cards right now here's my major complaint well, this is where my major complaint will come in for a lot of people because they don't think they'll be happy with me saying this. But if this match is going to happen, then there is absolutely no reason for Ronda Rousey to win the Raw Women's Championship at SummerSlam. I'm sorry, if this match is going to happen, there's no reason for her to be champion. I'm just being straight up honest with you. If she's going to win the championship and then go into this four horsewomen match as champion, then what's the point? What's the point? Because Stephanie said that these titles are going to be defended. If Charlotte or, or Becky or Ronda win the belts, they're going to pull double duty. They're going to have to pull double duty, defend the titles, and then be in that tag team match. Shayna Baszler is most likely going to lose the NXT Women's title. Because, and, and again, it's the same thing with her. Like, their defense, like the NXT Women's Championship is going to be at the event. So, why keep the belt on Shayna if she's going to be in this horsewomen match? These are the things that I want people to understand and want to see where I'm coming from from this. Sure, you can say it's better if they're champions if you want to. I don't, if you, if, and, and honestly, it devalues the titles. It, it will devalue the Raw and SmackDown women's titles if they're not defended. If they're bit just, if they're just, you know, they're just going to be put around Ronda and whoever, and Charlotte or Becky's waists for no reason. They're just going to be put around their waists for no reason at Evolution 
they're just gonna be there. They're just gonna be. They're just gonna be there. So that's just what I'm saying. There's just no reason for Charlotte, Becky, or Ronda to be champions. And, and some people might think it's better if they're champions. But again, it's like I said, they're just gonna be put around their waists for no reason. They're just gonna be there. They're just gonna be there as titles, just there to be worn and nothing more. They're only gonna be there as like, yeah, I'm the captain of this team and I'm the captain of this team. Like if Charlotte and, and Ronda win these titles, it's more like these two are champions because they're captain of their respective horsewomen team. That's pretty much what those belts are going to be there for as a sign of, yeah, I'm captain of MMA horsewomen, but I'm the captain of WWE horsewomen. That's what those belts are going to be for. That's why I think there is no reason to put the belts on them if that's going to be the case. I understand people want Carmella and Alexa Bliss to lose their titles. I understand how badly people want these two to lose their titles. But why not just have, you know, someone like Natalia win the Raw Women's Championship from Alexa Bliss. Have her stroll in to, you know, e Evolution as Raw Women's Champion. Put her up against maybe like Beth Phoenix or something. Or just find someone. You know, or, ju or just swallow the pill and just accept Bliss and Bliss and Carmella being champions just up to evolution and then this horsewomen match can be dealt with and then they can win their titles. I'm just saying, there's no reason to rush. This is the problem that I have with fans. All they want is rush, 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 rush. Everything done. Done, 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 done. Let's get this done. Let's get this done. Let's put the title on Ronda. Put the title on Charlotte. Get them together. Who cares about defending the titles? Just get them together. Rush, 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 rush. There's no need to rush. There's no need to rush. Ronda doesn't need to get a rocket, to, a rocket attached to her and just straight ro launched straight to the top. Well, technically she is anyway. So. I'm just saying, it's just not fair. To me, I think it's not fair. If you're just going to have Charlotte and Ronda... The reason why I'm saying Charlotte, because if anyone's going to win the SmackDown Women's title, it'll be Charlotte more than Becky. But... What I'm saying is, there would be... If you're just going to put the titles on Ronda and Charlotte or Becky... What are they there for? What are they there for? Like what I just said to you before. They're just there... They'll just be there to show that they're the captain of their team. That's pretty much what all the what all those titles are going to be for. It's either it's either you have Alexa and Carmella walk into Evolution as champions, or you find somebody else to take the titles from them and just let them be champions for a short period of time. Why not give? Why not, you know, like, look at SmackDown. You know, SmackDown could easily give, like, someone like Naomi a little small run. And then you can just put the belt on Charlotte. But, I feel like at this rate, that's most likely what's going to happen. Charlotte and Ronda are most likely going to win the titles, and they're not going to be defended. That's pretty much where, where it's going to be going. And I don't like that aspect. I don't like that aspect at all. I don't want to see two titles just being wasted away because people just prefer, you know, people people just would like it if they if you know the titles were not defended. If that's how if that's how it needs to be, then it's a damn shame. It's a damn shame that that's what they're going to do with the titles if this is going to happen. That's why some people think this should happen at WrestleMania. So that way there'll be no titles in the way. But right now, WWE Evolution seems to be the right time to push this match. It's either you do the match now, 
or don't do it at all. That That's pretty much the motto at this rate. And if you people just don't accept that, then then, 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 then where's your best best place? Survivor Series? There's no, there, there'll be no reason for Survivor Series. Sure, it would make a reason. Sure, it would make sense. Sure, it makes sense with the whole concept. But it's either you do it at Evolution, or you just don't do it at all. Because there's going to be times where you know it's the right time to do it, but then when WWE will do it at the wrong time. Which I know WWE should not do this at the wrong time. Like, wasting a B-level pay-per-view with this match? That's wrong time. The, one of the big four pay-per-views, Rumble, the Series, Slam, Mania. Maybe it'd be more best for Survivor Series or Mania. But considering that they've got an all-women pay-per-view coming up, it makes a lot of sense for it to happen here at the at Evolution. So like I said, it's either WWE does it now, or they don't do it at all. That's pretty much the, that's pretty much what I've got to say. So again, I, I I'm not saying I don't want to see this. I do want to see this. What 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 what? Why would I be stupid enough to not want this? Of course, I want to see this match happen. But I just want it to not be resorted to. Just WWE doing what they want. Oh, we'll put the title on Charlotte and Ronda. And make them captains. To me, we'll just devalue the titles. And the other negative is that we're going to be getting Charlotte and Ronda early. Because everyone's been wanting Charlotte. Well, WWE has been wanting Charlotte versus Rousey at WrestleMania. Maybe this match, maybe you could have... Team MMA win at Evolution, and then you have Ron, then you have Charlotte, you know, defending the honor of her team, WWE Horsewomen, and go into WrestleMania and defeat Rousey as a way of payback. Or they could do it the other way around. Team WWE win at Evolution, and Rousey beats Charlotte at Mania. But I think I know where they're going to go if this does happen. So, Anyway, that's pretty much the end of this video. I hope you guys did like it. Be sure to hit the thumbs up if you did enjoy. Comment your opinions down below. And do you think, or, or I shouldn't say think, do you want to see this match happen at Evolution? Or save it for WrestleMania? Thank you all for watching. Be sure to hit the thumbs up if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you haven't done so yet. Be sure to hit the notification bell as well so you'll be notified when my videos get uploaded. And be sure to follow me on my Twitter at PValentine to keep, to keep up to date. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in another video. Hope you guys later.